Yeah, so uh, uh, for folks who follow Kyoto and those protocols, the next round, the next commitment period, uh, will be signed off likely in Copenhagen in the early December, late November, early December. And uh, Canada's role up to this point is a little fishy as to what we're actually going to do. But it takes us from 2012, no one's 100% sure, to 2025 approximately. It's the next commitment. And Canada has obviously broken its first round of commitments quite badly. Yes, we're the, not, not ready. Are you going you know, I was on the phone with the minister today about Chalk River, which melted down again. It didn't melt down. Chalk River didn't melt down. It uh, leaked. Our isotopes are running out again. Um, and uh, we're talking, we're negotiating that. I'm not going to go to be a uh, garden where they just try to use you as a puppet. Um, but I will go if there's some freedom. They try to control you when you get there. It's quite a thing. You, you see that they, it's amazing to watch. They don't want you speaking. Who's they? The government of Canada. Yeah, they bureaucrats or both. They get instructions. So when I was in Bali, they actually shunted me out of the uh, place before I got there. I hadn't even said anything yet, and, they, and so I had to go in with the NGOs. And so an elected member of Parliament wasn't with the you Canadian don't have status delegation. As a delegate. Okay. They, they, we have up until last year. That's been Canada's history for ever up until last year. I, something I must have said. <laughs> Any uh, response? Uh, questions? You want to challenge? Um, I was going to say, in regards to Copenhagen, what can we as 